9.1.2, how can I find a missing angle? This section is about finding unknown angles in triangles. But before we get started with the problems for this, let's do a short exploration of triangles. Here's a triangle, and here are a couple of questions. If we add up all the angles of a triangle, what will it be equal to? And will it always be the same with different size triangles and different shapes of triangles? All right, well, we're going to explore that. The first thing that I'm going to do is I want to find out what happens when I add up all the angles of this triangle. So rather than measure it, I'm just going to cut off all the corners of this triangle and then line them up and see what happens. So I've cut off the corners and we knew every corner was a different color. So now I am lining up all the corners. And as we can see, especially if we put something very straight next to this, all three of these pieces line up to make a straight line which, as we know, is equal to 180 degrees, because here a straight angle is equal to 180 degrees. So when we add up all these triangle um, angles, it's equal to 180 degrees. Okay, well that worked for that triangle, but does it work for every triangle? Let's try a few other triangles. Here's a triangle that's a very different shape. And in this case, we know that this angle is 55 degrees, so is this one. And this one, we don't know what that angle is. So I'm going to take a different corner, because there are three copies of this. I'm going to take a different corner of the triangle and line them all up. And once I do, you can see that once again, it's a straight line. And so this triangle also, when we add up all the angles, adds up to 180 degrees because a straight line is a straight angle. Let's try a few others and see what happens. All right, here's another triangle shape. This one looks very different from the other two. Now let's line up some of these angles. Okay, and now that we've done it, we can see that yet again, it um, lines up to be a straight line which is, which means that all the angles of the triangle add up to 180 degrees. All right, we'll try one more triangle and see if it's true of this one too. So this one has yet again a different shape and this is an 80 degree, a 60 degree, and an unknown angle. So let's add these up, the 60, the 80, and the unknown. So we'll put them all together, and yes, once again, all the angles of the triangle add up to 180 degrees. So at this point, we can make a conjecture that all the angles of a triangle always will add up to 180 degrees.